Hello, welcome to Kent Beer Reviews. Right, a beer from a brewery I've not had before. It's from the Vocation Brewery. It's their Heart and Soul Session IPA, 4.4% ABV. Um, I've got a little range of these beers coming up, so I think I've got about four different ones. So, so yeah, you know, I know this is continuing my IPA kind of week. It might be a little longer than a week, but um, it's amount of hoppy IPAs that have just, you know, this isn't recent but there's a lot of others that have come out um, I've had some good things about this brewery so they're out of West Yorkshire uh, Heden Bridge West Yorkshire um, it's got date best before so 16th of October for you guys in America we have the date on the left and then the uh, the bump in the middle you have it the other way around so yeah quite a nice looking can Let's give this a whirl then. Another canned craft beer. God, it looks very smooth foam on the top of the can. Very light, sessionable. These beers apparently are unfiltered, which is a good thing. It keeps a bit more flavour, I think. In bit of a silly pour, two finger head on this third glass but at this stage it's very clear looks a bit like a um, a sour at this stage so you can see the light coming through there it's getting aroma Ooh. Amazing the amount of small beers ABV wise now that you can get, but they just hopped up to the arse. Sort of mango, pineapple, maybe slight grapefruitness, citriness. Very bright, vibrant, smelling. Wow. Lots of little fine bubbles. Get the right side so you can see it. Give it a try anyway. Cheers. A little sharp bitter at the front. Yeah. Sharpness. Pineapple, maybe, maybe some lighter fruits notes in there. Hmm, pretty nice. This kind of hints of not pine, but some mango or apricot, maybe. nice it's a nice session beer you could drink a you know a few of these very nice looking beer very clean it's got a bit of writing on the back here's a bit about the brewery vocation is a fiercely independent brewery hell-bent on producing punchy and distinctive beers over long days and sleepless nights we pursue perfection with dogged determination and never compromise our vision. This relentless persistence makes our beers bold, brave and never anything less than exhilarating. Vocationbrewery.com Now a bit about this beer. Uh, this is our brewery's heart and soul. Created to have a hoppy goodness goodness of an IPA but brewed to a sensible strength <laughs> its intense fruit salad character comes from generous editions of West US West Coast hops whatever they are I don't know the hop varieties I imagine there's a bit of citra in there maybe I'm probably wrong 
I like to have a guess though. Then if I do find out. Um, Citra for sure. It's a little bit dry. It's like a dry hop kind of thing. Full bodied and fruity beer with notes of passion fruit. Oh, there you go. Grapefruit, gooseberry, yeah. pineapple, mango, certainly them too. Um, our beer is naturally hazy because filtering kills the flavour. Exactly. Never part dry, store, store cool, drink fresh. So it's quite a long shelf life on this. So what's it? When did I get these? Uh, I got these about three weeks ago. Maybe, maybe longer. Maybe mid March. So month month ago. So March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October. That's a long. That's a long shelf life for a low ABV beer. And <coughs> excuse me, one that's hoppy. I definitely want to drink this. You know, as soon I've got so many IPAs to do. Gonna sneeze. Sorry about this. <coughs> Doing it all day. <coughs> right, you can you can press play now. After that, fast forward. Right. Um, as I was saying, yeah, a low ABV beer. I wouldn't want to be drinking it after seven months. Even if I know it's in a can, it's probably still going to be all right. But it's just me. Definitely a fruit salad saladiness to this beer. You're getting hints of all of the things I've just mentioned. It's a little bit bitter at the front end, but then it's has a slight dry hoppiness to it, to me. But it's very nice. It's not overly sweet. It's a well-made beer. Very nice. As for a rating then for Heart and Soul. Session IPA at 4.4% from the Vocation Brewery. Um, I'll give that an 8 out of 10. That's an 8 out of 10 from me. Um, it's very nice. You can get it on most um, online beer stores. I got this beer from Beers of Europe. Not Beers of Europe. Idiot. Ales by Mail. Sorry. Ales by Mail, they do this. Along with many other of their range which I'll be coming up in the next few weeks so if you've had it before let us know what you think you also always find out how you get on with these beers or whatever drop us a line and I'll see you next time cheers